coloring process a little bit. Three different type carpet we produce, Volon wool, Volon cotton, and silk on silk. To remember easy, city carpet, village carpet, and silk on silk. City carpet is wool on cotton because always intricate, produced in the big looms, in the big cities, at the workshops. Wool on wool carpets are always geometrical designs and produced in their village, in their houses. Because of carpet produced in the village, they really don't need any chemical product for dyeing their yarns. They have got their own plants, roots, minerals. Red color we get from cherry or meadow root. Do you know meadow root? M-E-D-D-E-R? It's a very simple root you can find everywhere of the world. When you boil this, red color comes out of it. Mm. Brown is walnut mm. shells. Mm. Yellow is daisy. Sometimes wow. we add saffron to mix the color with more well, in all mm. Pink is red onion skin. Uh, blue, any ID for the blue? You have an ID? Indigo. Yes, indigo. Ladies and gentlemen, we have almost 8,000 carpet in this house. It is impossible to produce that amount of carpet in this workshop with a couple of ladies. Believe me, it will take maybe forever. We have 2,800 carpet weavers in 24 different villages in the of Cappadocia and over 5,000 new exist all over the country. Uh, every carpet weaver has got the pattern in front of them. Ladies and gentlemen, there are lots of little squares on the pattern. Each square on the pattern, it means each knot on the carpet. There are two techniques in the world for the knot system. Double knot technique and a single knot technique. Here in Turkey, we use double knot technique, but other oriental countries, they use single. What is the difference? Two person, always stronger than one person. Double knot will be stronger than single knot. That's the only difference. Ladies and gentlemen, first of all, for making a carpet, we need carpet loom. For making a knot, ladies and gentlemen, carpet weaver will take two vertical threads. Vertical threads are double. So they will take one from the back part, one from the front part, hold it side by side, like the ladies are holding at the moment for us. And after, with wool yarn, they're going to wrap both of the vertical threads. One, two. One, two. We call that double knot. We're going to pull it down and break it. To make that tie. In that case, they can tie more knots in this way. Centimeter, and they can go to the tails of the design. And last process will be trimming the longest parts of the pile with the sharp carpet scissors like this. Wow, excuse me, man. this lady asking to me, that lady wanna say I love you to us. Shoulder, finger, eyes, and delivery. That means that they don't work eight hours a day. What they do, they work 10 minutes, 20 minutes, take the break. Actually, this is a problem. You cannot tell them to do it. It's a puzzle. It has to come from the heart. So they give off two breaks. On and off, on and off. In one day, in that quality, they gave her three, three and a half hours. That's why it takes a long time to go. One square meter size. That lady over there, when she made the nuts, she break the yarn by hand. Here, as you see, she has got a knife in her hand. After each knot, she has to cut it with the knife because silk is the strongest natural fiber which we use in textile. Old parachutes, old sails, hot air balloons made by silk. Many people, especially ladies, are telling me this. Ariel, I love silk carpet, but I don't want to use them on the floor. Because of silk, I prefer to hang them on the wall. Yes, silk is beautiful on the wall. It's like a painting, like a picture, a piece of art. But you know what? If you want, you can also use the silk carpets on the floor, and believe me, it will last much, much longer than wool on wool or wool on cotton carpets. 
You may put on a heavy traffic area and let everybody walk. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you Lady Aisha. Okay. And let me introduce you Mr. Kakun. <laughs> Mr. Kakun and Lady Aisha both comes from Bursa. Bursa is the name of the city at the southern parts of Marmara Sea where we have lots of cocoon farms and mulberry trees. We raise our own cocoon in Bursa. But in Bursa, they really don't interest any carpet production. Even they don't make a wool carpet. They interest more textile business with silk. Two regions in Turkey reproduce silk carpet with one of them is Cappadocia, where we are right now. And the second name is called Hereke. Have you ever heard this name before? Actually, yes, you heard it. Let me remind you. On 1999, remember, we had a huge big earthquake. earthquake. Hereka was the center, little of the pupa inside. The worm, they eat the mulberry leaves, produce the silk filaments, cover itself from outside to inside, stay in 13, 14 days, and after made a little hole, comes out as a moth. From one normal size cocoon, like this one in my hand, we may get minimum 800 meters, which means one uh, 2,400 feet, maximum 1.2 mile, almost one and a half kilometer silk filaments in this finest, wow. without break, one piece continuously. Mm. But when the cocoons are dry, even a meter, even a feet, we cannot take it out. It's gonna break all the time. The reason, we put them into the hot water to make them more flexible. 30, 40 minutes, we do not touch them. Now, she's gonna, she gonna keep, uh, put the cocoons in a hot water. And with this brush, she's gonna punch the top of the cocoons and try to catch the beginning parts of the filaments, like this. If you like it, you can touch it, you can feel it, very tiny, very little, but it's very strong for what it is. Now what she's gonna do is, she will take all those cocoon, top level, from that pool and transfer to do this pool. The water over there, it's just warm water. It may come to this side. Ladies and gentlemen, what she's doing now, she's gonna collect roughly 20, 25 of them. Normally 20, 25 of them. But for you, because you're taking a picture, she's gonna do more than 20, 25. And pass from those little hooks, and it will go to machine for unraveling. Now she gets some silk, and pass from the hooks. Goes over the wheel, and give it a twist over there. Gentlemen, I'm sorry. This part will move, be careful please. A little bit, be careful. So. Now look at over here, all of the mist. Oh my God. Start to unravel. Give me your hand please. Look at over here, if you don't see, she's going to show all of them to us. There you go. Use your flash, it will be better for you. Here is the yarn, which we took from the machine over here. Oh one of this one has got 25 filaments. I mean, 25 of this one. Can you see? No. It's made one of this one over here. Wow. Uh, what's your name, lady? Vicky. Vicky, would you do like this, please, Vicky? Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, what I... <laughs> Shame on you, Vicky. Vicky, this finger, okay? Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, what I told you over there, silk is the strongest natural fiber which we use in textile. So, if I pull this one, 
That means Wiki will have one finger less. Yes. <laughs> Are you ready? Yep. Yep. <laughs> Ooh, I never tried that before. Okay. One, two, three. Beautiful. Is it hurt? Nope. And fingers still here. <laughs> All the fingers are still here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, would you look at over here? Wow. It's very weak, easy to break. We will get four of these together. We will spin them. One of this one has got 25 of this times four, 100. When 100 of this one comes together, we will get five of it and spin them to opposite direction. And it's gonna turn to 500. And here is the yarn, which has got 500 of these little wow. filaments inside. And this is pretty strong. Can I prove, Vicky? Yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> Thanks for your trust, but I don't want your finger. I'm definitely going to cut your finger. That reason, I want both of your hands. And you try to break by yourself. Uh, Vicky, if you break it, I'll give you a free carpet. <laughs> <laughs> Let me try it then. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, every group I'm telling, if you break it, I'll give you a free carpet. One day, I was giving a presentation to another group. One gentleman was standing at the right side of me. He asked to me, Ariel, may I try? I look at him. He looks very little, tiny. I thought he is the right customer. <laughs> I'll give the yarn to him. And I turn to the rest of the group and say, if you break it, I'll give you a free carpet. At the same time, I heard snap. Oh, no. <laughs> you should see my face. <laughs> yeah, but you should have seen his. <laughs> anyway, promise is promise. I will give you a free carpet. But Wiki, did I promise the size of the carpet? No. <laughs> Little one. I'll pay extra from my pocket and never use this words again. Anyway, he holds my shoulder and say this, Ariel, don't panic. I don't want a free carpet. I say thank you, but how did you do this? He said this. When you turn your face to the group and say, if you break it, I'll give you a free carpet. At the same time, I just made a one very simple knot. Vicky, this is the same yarn you try to break, but the difference is that little knots at this center. When you make that little knots to the center, ladies and gentlemen, and when you do this, it gets great. Ah. <laughs> you were that much close. Next time, next time. That's the trick. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, I didn't break it. Silk is a sharp material. When you made the knots over there, it just cut itself. In the old time, they were using the silk for cutting the mines. It comes from eastern parts of Turkey, nearby Ararat Mountain. Tell the stories of the Noah's Ark. That's why you're going to see lots of little animal designs on that. Tell the stories of the Noah's Ark. And the coming one will be pure wool embroidery. No silk, no cotton, all wool embroidery. I mean, if you have a time, I can show you 8,000 of our carpets to you. But now I will show you the assembly from each carpet. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we would like to show you the carpets. And wool on wool, it's going to be our first category. Always geometrical designs, always big bulkier pattern because it's a thick material wool. Wool is a thick material. It's a less nuts, less squares. You need that with the designs of the uh, generally, ladies and gentlemen, we produce the carpet in five standard sizes. Number one will be this size. It's just a going one. Number one will be this one, ladies and gentlemen. Three by five. One, one and a half square meter size. This is a uh, this is the size we call <coughs> gift or a sweeter size. Nice memory from Turkey size. Number two will be four feet by six feet. Two two and a half square meter size. This is a good size for living room, dining room, kitchen, bedroom, entrance on the wall, on the floor, under the furniture, over the furniture, wherever you want. You can easily use this size. Number three will be the runner for the hallways or stairs. We have them in longer, shorter, wider, or narrow. Number four will be five by seven. Three, three and a half square meter size. Living room or bedroom size. Imagine your coffee table at the center. Three person character size will look beautiful. And number five will be seven by ten, two by three. 
<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is a good size for living room or dining room. This is car. So of course we have larger than this, much, much smaller than this, or other between sizes, but these are the five standard sizes. Now, my friends will show us different traditional wool or wool carpets from different parts of Turkey. Please enjoy with them. Whenever you want, you can stand up, you can walk on them, you can touch them, you can feel them, you can buy them. It comes from tobacco plants. In Cappadocia, we don't have any tobacco plantation. That reason, no chance to make that design in this car. Right now, all the carpets on the floor made by sheep wool, but the coming one is very special, which is made by lamb. Oh my God, that? Baby sheep wool. If you don't mind, after my friends roll this carpet down, as they did, would you all together stand up and touch the surface of this one and feel the softest of the metal? Please do it. <laughs> Wow, that's amazing. Wow. How does it do that? Open it up. Yeah. 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 Let's say you like that one, but you prefer a different color, <laughs> or this one in different size. Out of no obligation, you may ask to talk to my friends. They will invite you to another showroom to show you the carpets on the bare floor. Show the one you like to my friends and let them to invite you to other rooms and let's show you some other sizes, colors without any no obligation. So I want to say thank you very much for your kind attention. Thank you. Thank you.